knife. Not necessary. To, oh, I like this one because you're going to hate it when you sharpen that knife. You got your backwards, you got to turn it, poke it with a file. That is not a good idea. It don't work well. So let's see. Oop. Okay, if I slow down, it'll cut. Watch how much it changes and how light I touch. Brush, don't dig. What am I doing? Hard, sharp, 90 degree corners. This one is really cool because it's got the sharpener on the end, but it's also got something that screws into the handle. It's called a ferrocium rod. It's a mix between magnesium and ferrous, whatever. So in other words, you got that. This is my most favorite because wherever I go, I make my fires with it. Watch this. Gentle. Don't push hard. Let it slide right down through there. Then last one. Then light. And just, just let it slide. And then slide it right on out. Down here. Maybe today all I have is my littlest one with me. Fits right in your pocket. By the way, this one fits really well in your watch pocket or flat in your pocket. So we brush along like this. Don't push too hard. Let it work. Don't make it work. Just like that. Turn it over. Slide. I don't have a hold of the sharpener. I want it to float. Why? I cannot encourage the sharpener to cut. Unless I let it touch and then push. I might do this to it with a little more pressure than that. Alright, let's see what we now have. That's a world of diff difference. Even out here. There's absolutely no such thing. Yes, and this is the same. I'll take it. <laughs> Just, I got three. Yeah. Yes. And I like the 